This is the new way. That is amazing. Great sons, everyone. Princess of the Berry here. We landed on Batu today because we had to pick up a package. Apparently something called breakfast? This is, we're actually here early in the morning because Bear had a craving. I did? For Ronto Roasters. We flew all the way here just for that. A nice roasted Ronto. So we're going to Ronto Roasters for breakfast. Be sure to stay in the style boys. I heard the girl. There are several locations around Walt Disney World where you can get a cup of water, especially on a hot day. Make sure that you get that cup of water and you hydrate yourself, especially in the summer. It is ridiculously humid here. Drink up. Every time we land here on Batu, I feel myself thirsty for something. And every time we come to Ronto Roasters, I just get a feeling inside that makes me wish that Oga's either had mobile ordering or a to-go window. Of course, a cooler will cool you, but it's just not the same as jet juice first thing in the morning. I feel cold and refreshed. I wish I had a maker's floater, but it's still refreshing here in the shade while all the uh, citizens walk around in the heat. Three point two five out of five bars. I feel like every time we drink one of these, it gets weaker. So this is a fruit cup. We last time we were here reviewed this location. They didn't have this. They added it later, and we just haven't been back. So this fruit cup has tamarind on it with um, a little bit of the peppercorn ash, which is really interesting. I think I'm gonna take this yarmulke here. Oh, it looks so good. It takes me back to eating tamarind candy in Mexico. This is really good. If you get a bite without the tamarind sauce, it's not as good. Like you definitely want it to be swimming in the sauce and there's just a drizzle of sauce on it. So I feel like it needs to come with like a little cup of sauce or you just need to make it swim in the sauce for it to be complete fire. As it is, it's a nice like healthy, healthy snack. I will give it three and a half out of five fruits. It does make me feel a little bit fruity. I'm always is amazed how they make these things that are just basically like fruit fries, basically. They make them look somewhat alien by adding fruits and a sauce that people don't normally see every day. Just gonna go in. I just wish they gave you more sauce. They're definitely not saucy enough. Not even close. Look at that. That looks alien. With goo and seeds and whatnot. Not bad. That should be quite like chill and refreshing. It's just uh, the lack of sauce. I mean, the sauce tastes really good. It's sort of like pepper and tamarind. It's a really good mix. I just wish I had more of it. Uh, if you're looking for a quick snack for the kids, probably, this is probably a great deal and or value. If you're an adult, you're gonna, this is going to leave you wanting for more. I give that Two and a half out of five plus. And here we have my favorite thing to eat for breakfast here at Hollywood Studios. For some reason they gave us two on accident. I'm not mad at that. Always delicious. Always consistent. Super tasty Ronto wrap. I wish that they served it for more hours out of the day. Like I wish they served breakfast till like two. I think that's a fair time. But you have to rush to the parks to get this if you want this for breakfast. It is spicy. So if you are not looking for something spicy, you don't want to get this. But I would say it's like a, a four out of 10 on the heat scale, maybe a three out of 10. Not super spicy, but spicy. I would say this is a princessity's item. This is a five out of five, and you always should come here for quick service breakfast if you do not have a table service reservation and you're not, and you're in the parks already. You got some time to kill. This is the way. So you come here for morning Ronto, then realize why should the Ronto suffer? You're gonna eat breakfast. So you get this uh, spiced chickpea salad with just eggs. And the same sort of like toasted pita. 
I can do pitas for every meal, but this one here at Run of the Roasters is one of our favorites. Any excuse, like if the princess come here to get this, we come. That's why we're here today. Ah. That subtle heat, I'd probably give it like a one out of ten on the spice but the heat is there. Uh, a rush of flavor in your mouth. It's heat, it's flavor. Chickpeas are cooked really nicely, like nice and soft, not like crunchy or like that. And then a just egg adds like that savory bit in there for a flavorful bite. It is literally one of the best, like, sort of like quick service grab and go style things that you can get. Literally pick up a pocket, a ronto, or this breakfast wrap and just run with it. Go stand in line for fries, go stand in smugglers, have a little snack while you ate. With a cooler. I literally cannot get enough of this thing. I wish I had room for the second one they accidentally gave us because I would eat that whole thing. Five out of five paws. Always on the bare necessities list. I would easily take this one over the non-plant mess one any day of the week. Here we have the single Ronto that was hurt for the filming of this video. A nice breakfast smoked sausage wrapped in egg with a nice cheddar cheese and then no sauce. Now what makes it so weird compared to the vegan one is that it comes with sauce. This thing comes dry as a Tatooine desert. So strange. I think right beneath the egg, there is a sauce. But there's so little of it compared to what you get in the vegan version of this, that it's, it might as well not even be there. You can't taste it over the smokiness of the sausage and then the egg. It just sort of disappears. And it's still just very, very dry. I like the smokiness. I just wish it had more of a complimentary sauce to go with it. And it would be a five. As it is, it's three and a half out of five plus. Shame on the Ronto. We've been all about Disney Parks food hacks lately. We have an extra run, we have an extra breakfast wrap filled with chickpeas. And I have a breakfast Ronto with uh, one bite taken out of it. I'm just gonna slide that in there like that. Maybe this will solve my sauce problems. One bite from this in. Where I haven't already taken a chunk out of it. Mm. Mm. This is a new way. That is amazing. What about six out of ten gloss? Six out of five gloss. I forgot my brain. That tastes so well. A smoked sausage on top of the chickpea salad with that sauce. Exactly what I was hoping for. This is my new favorite. I don't know if I want to come here and spend twenty dollars on breakfast. But by chance you get two of these, this is the hack for you. If you're brave enough, try it. Looks like it got mauled by a bear. If you see one, let us know in the comments. We love Ronto Roasters. I still can't for the life of me understand why it closes so early. Yes, it's very, very difficult to get here on time, I feel, if you have any other activities to do. They're open from 9 to 3. And like That's this it. place is packed for open to close usually, so logistical doesn't make sense. We love this place. We wish that it maybe had an expanded seating area, maybe some rotating yeah. options, they maybe a couple more drinks options. Thank here. you. This place needs in the restaurant badly. But we know what you guys think. Do you guys even come to Rental Roast anymore? Is it a first thing in the morning and then skip for the rest of the day? Do you even bother? Let us know in the comments below. If there's anything else you prefer to do when you get to Hollywood every day, let us know in the comments below. If there's anything else you can see us do, of course, that's always in your place to find us. Hit that notification bell for other videos like this, and... We have new videos five days a week. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Saturday, Wednesday. We will see you soon. Be sure to subscribe. More bears will eat himself off the bus you and never come back. I'm, I'm taking a ship, of course, but I will eat myself. Give it up for the dress.